Let's welcome back our LD expert, the assistant night manager from 112 Video, Mr. Joe Lynch. It's a party. Yeah, Woo. great to have you back. I want to get you. right into this because there's a lot of big movies out right now. First up, we've got one of last year's best films, Jim Cameron's Aliens. Now, with this film winning a couple of Oscars this year for best sound and special effects, how do you think it holds up on this laser disc? Aliens is one of the best laser discs I have ever seen in and, my life. And it holds up on, on, on this movie. Not only do you have pure quadraphonic stereo sound, uh -huh. but the best picture, I, I, I couldn't see any lines at all. Absolutely, really? Absolutely none. And you like not seeing lines? I, I, hey, I like lines like the next guy. Yeah, right? Yeah, but... Thank you. Some other people like to enjoy mm -hmm. laser discs with a little help. Okay, so but you're saying they're here to stay. They are absolutely here to stay. Oh, that's a that's a big. Mark that's a, my can words. Can we quote you on that? You can quote me on it. Laser disc oh, is the man. wave of the future. Okay, well, I'm going to ask you bottom line on on this movie. What do you think about it? Well, I mean, if you're a fan of Jim mm -hmm. Cameron's movie, yeah. I mean, he only did one movie before uh, Terminator. Yes. Awesome, <laughs> awesome movie, and this is definitely a natural progression, a nice sequel. It's a definite rent. Okay. I'd say a definite rent. Whatever that guy does next, I mean, you know, whatever. Yeah. You know, maybe well, he's poised you to get, be. One time you get one or two big hits and then that's it for you. But, you know, you never know. You just I keep trying. I he think he, he's not going to hit the sophomore slump just yet. It's what he does next that's going to make the difference. Oh, okay. Well, we keep watching for him. Now, I have to ask you about this. Not many people know about our next film, but it seems to be growing a real cult following. Let's talk about Evil Dead 2. Woo! Dead by Dawn. Awesome. Yeah, so this is a horror film, but it seems to be a bit cartoonish, right? Tell people about it. Well, Evil Dead 2 is the sequel to the uh, the first, obviously, mm -hmm. Evil Dead, which uh, Stephen King called one of the most brutal experiences he's ever had with a film. Hey, Stephen King, the guy yeah, knows right? what he's talking about. You know, I mean, he just made Maximum Overdrive. The guy must be he a genius. He knows horror. He knows he his knows stuff. He knows horror. So you have this movie directed by Sam mm -hmm. Ramai. You know, I mean, he's done a couple, you know, he's I done that. I believe it's Raimi is what they were telling me. I believe me it's Ramai. Okay, you know, Ramai. Let, let's let's okay. get that right. Come on. It is hilarious. It's one of those movies that, um, that like, in this new kind of genre called the splatter movie, mm -hmm. which is horror and comedy and action all kind of mashed up into one. And lots of gore. Lots no one's, oh, of gore. I don't, think that, I don't think that people are ever going to like a lot of blood in the The guts. gore factor no. in this is absolutely killer. So what's the bottom line? Oh, the bottom line is to absolutely buy this disc because I guarantee there will never be another version of this, this laser disc ever. Oh. Ever. Well, that's This is to... the definitive version. All right. Well, that's something to know. Now, I want to talk about... Uh, one of my favorite comedies of the year, Short Circuit. Oh, this was the... Right? Who out here doesn't love Short Circuit? <laughs> the fact... The, I, no, I know. The, the fact that they got a, a robot that's so lifelike to talk and interact with people, it's amazing what they did. Absolutely amazing that you can have such drama between a robot and, and, the, and the sheer dramatic force uh -huh. that is Steve Gutenberg. Look at him right there. I mean, oh. that's... I mean, the facial expressions alone were amazing. I, I think that Steve Gutenberg is poised to be our generation's Brando. I can't even disagree with you right there. That's, the, uh, but I have to get to the bottom line. I have, I have to. I know what you're going to say, right? I know what you're going to say. I don't know. Can you read my mind? Bye. Absolute buy. Oh! Absolute buy. Yeah. I mean, it's number five, yeah. and it's alive, yeah. and it's a buy. Yeah, that's right. Now, I love having you here, so I'm not going to let you go without seeing one of your, your quick picks for us. What, what laser disc do you have for Ooh, us? Ooh, I got something that my cousin, who's, who has a little friend who's got a friend who's got a friend in the black market, yeah. has got me the summer's hottest film already on Laserdisc. No. Video Laserdisc no. of Joel Schumacher's The Lost no. Boys. It's one of the first Laserdiscs that's actually letterboxed. I don't know if you've ever heard of this before. No. It's a new concept. It's totally tubular. I love it. Okay. It's actually showing you what it looks like from the, the theatrical experience. Because what you're watching in normal TV yeah. is you're watching it, you know, kind of squished in. Yeah. This has little black bars on the top and the bottom. So you see less on your screen. Mm -hmm. I would love that. No, no, you see Thank more. Thank you so much. No, no, you Joe don't get Lynch, my you point. are awesome. But you, get, you see Thanks. more. But you see more. Video Le letterbox, letterbox. Yeah, see less in the But it's Letterboxd. It's, it's, it's great. It's le well, letterbox. That's it for Laserdisc DVD, or Laserdisc Tuesday and one more breaking movie story. They've just announced that the show Police Squad is being turned into a movie with the original cast and also starring American football hero O.J. Simpson. But don't worry, O.J. won't have to play a bad guy or anything. 
just be himself. Attack of the Show, weeknights at 7, only on G4.